Hi, I'm April. And I'm Gary. And uh, today we're going to talk about uh, the different types of uh, what they call, what you would call clip art in, uh, in, in Microsoft Word. But today we're going to do it in OpenOffice. Um, OpenOffice, as, uh, as I'm sure you know, is a very close comparison to Microsoft Word. And uh, Microsoft Word offers some you know, clip art, pictures, things that you can put into your, uh, your documents. But uh, OpenOffice doesn't exactly call it that, and it causes a little bit of confusion. So today, we're going to go over on the computer and show you the, where you can find the art, or we're going to call it clip art, here for OpenOffice. So I'll turn it over to April. We're going to go to check it out on the computer, and we'll show you now. OK, uh, what we need to know about OpenOffice uh, clip art is that uh, it's available for not only the writer, but also the calc and the impress and your draw program. The question is, where is it? Because they don't call it clip art. Our instinct, of course, is to go to the insert menu and picture. And we're thinking, great, yeah, no. From file or scan it. There's nothing there that says, hey, open it up and let's look at what there is to look at. So it's not under picture, it's not under object. What you're going to be looking for is they put their art in something called a gallery. Imagine that, art in a gallery. And you can uh, access that via the tools menu or through the gallery button right there. Looks like a little hanging picture. And this is what you get to go through. Um, they call them themes, not the same as the newer office themes in the sense that you've got fonts and color schemes. Basically each theme is a category. And they do provide some pictures as you can see. It's not an amazing amount, but there are backgrounds and bullets, um, home page type pictures for uh, web things. I could see where they'd also be great buttons for uh, presentations. My theme will come empty. You can add to it, obviously. That'll be the next tip. Um, rulers being you know, your divider lines. And they actually have some sounds in there that you can play with. To insert any of these things, all you really have to do is locate the one you want and you can drag it right into your document. From there, it's a matter of formatting and, and all the other stuff you would normally do. So we do have them. They are available, but you gotta find them in the gallery. So there you have it. Uh, Open Office has a gallery where all your art can be found. And stay tuned for Tuesday's tip where we'll cover adding your own pictures to your own personal themes in the gallery. So there you have it. Um, we uh, just wanted to thank you for stopping by today. Um, as always, if you're watching this on YouTube, uh, please feel free to stop by our website. It's www.worldstart.com. From the website, you can sign up for our newsletter. It's available right on the page there. We send out this newsletter every day, and it has these, uh, these videos and also a lot of other great tips that you can check out. If you have a question for us, stop by worldstart.com slash ask and uh, just ask your question there and we'll be happy to answer it and maybe even here on the video. Thanks, have a great day.